guys, I'm ready to show you what to expect when you start using the Oculus Quest 2. So I've got the headset on, It's so there should be a light somewhere there. Um, I've got my controllers, so each have a label. So this is the right hand controller and the left hand controller. But the nice thing is that, you know, let's say you put on your headset before you, you know, pick this up. Obviously, you won't be able to see which controller is which. But the moment that your, your Oculus is on, um, they can show you which controller is which. So that's pretty dope. Um, yeah, so what to, what to expect is that you need a Facebook account. Um, I think I heard some, oh yes, I did hear that they are trying to get rid of that. So meaning all you might need is an Oculus account instead of a Facebook account. So for me, the reason why I wasn't buying these headsets for the longest time is because I don't have a Facebook account and yeah, I'm one of those people basically. But yeah, well, I eventually just, you know, got it and I'm like, you know what, um, let me just do this. So yeah, so you need so to when you switch it on, um, it, I believe if I remember very well, you'll be asked to log on with your Facebook account or your your um, Oculus account. Oh, Lord. Or your Oculus account. Um, then you need to uh, set a pin. You need to set a, a, a pattern. Um, I know that the first time when I got the Oculus, I didn't need to do all the stuff, like the pins and the pattern. Yeah. But, and so yeah, once you've done that, you will then be shown a video, a short video of like the safety guidelines. Um, you have to acknowledge those safety guidelines. So, you know, they just pretty much saying that if anything happens to you, we warned you, you know, so at your own risk. Um, yeah, so once you've acknowledged the safety guidelines, you then have to set um, your boundary, your boundary space right um so you will have to you know set the level that you the floor level and then you know you you, you circle or square or heart or create a heart shaped boundary <laughs> basically um yeah so once you create the boundary then you're all set you know good to go um something to 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 notice that if you're sitting down um you will have to um, set a stationary boundary instead of like um, a larger boundary and then if you're standing um, you're, you, you need to have enough space I think they say about a meter by a meter you know you should be able to move about a meter by a meter like um, it within your boundary um, if it's if it's small you sort of like uh, uh, then they, you automate they automatically ask you to set a stationary boundary so yeah just something to look out for um, yeah, and then once you're in, then there's a video which is called First Steps, which I'm going to take you through it. The nice thing is, you know, you can go through the First Steps um, uh, video over and over, you know. So that First Steps um, video, um, app, it's actually like an app really. It helps you to, um, on how to, it guides you on how to use the Oculus. So how to use the, the buttons, which button is for what, how to grab things, how to move around. Um, yeah, so guys, let me show you how that looks like. So yeah, this is the environment.
done this before so I <laughs> yeah so my boundary is freaking small guys it is freaking small when you're ready to explore another virtual world insert the cartridge into the console so i think the issue now is that i don't have my my environment on on this on this account so i would need to pretty much get um, the environment set up. You can actually choose which virtual home you want to um, land on whenever you, you know, switch on your Oculus. And um, yeah, so I like this desert one. Let me install this one. It's funny enough because when I, I think because I'm using a new account, um, the account that is um, set up with this, with, with this, um, headset um i couldn't cast with it because somehow the facebook account i'm having issues with it um but yeah so this is the desert environment how dope is this guys this is too dope um i can't move to it uh, <laughs> it's literally just an environment um the moment though you press on the oculus sign you can get your menu back just want to check if i'm still centered okay cool um yeah you can get your menu back so we've got that desert terrace um the quest dome there's also a quest dome there um the space station pretty dope let me show you how, how it looks like it's kind of taking long to download now Installing, installing, launch. How dope is this? Right, this oh, I'm so close to my boundary. But yeah, my guys. So you can choose to land to this, which is so freaking cool. 
Toodles. Um,